went to uh, Sweden and then we went to London with uh, uh, 20 people from all over the world, but mostly from MAPA. MAPA means most affected peoples and areas. And this is so important because in the last COP, I, I had the opportunity to wander and I realized the sub-representation of young people from the Global South and, for example, from my country and from Latin America in general uh, in this type of international event. And with Friday for Future MAPA, we are working a lot to change that. And I'm happy to see more young people from all over the world, but especially from MAPA uh, in this event, because I think Kevin already uh, said that a, a little bit, but I think this is so important because we are not just passive victims of the climate crisis, but we are also part of the solution and they can't uh, decide anything without us. As I was saying, I think one of my main demands as a collective, as a movement, is talking about financing because the countries of the global north that are the most responsible for the climate crisis has an ob obligation to finance not only the just transition of the global south, but also adaptation. Uh, because the countries of the global south don't have the money to deal with the consequences that our countries are already suffering because of the climate crisis. And it's not only mitigation, because our countries are not the ones that emit the most, but, uh, but about our adaptation, because for us it not, it's not about numbers, we are talking about life and the violation of our basic human rights. And that's why uh, I think that one of the main points, one of my main demands for this COP is to start talking about financing because world leaders promised uh, two years ago to give money from uh, countries from the Global South.